Assalamu alaikum everyone and uh, Pepe right now, uh, let's talk about it. So I don't really think if Pepe wants to continue any higher, we might actually be uh, possibly rejected right over here. This is my personal take. Uh, there is no any, um, you know, continuation of uh, Pepe to move to the upside. You've actually been brutally rejected previously. So you came up here and that's pretty much the end of it. You got rejected right there. And you also ended up making some few uh, bearish candles. So let's talk about if Pepe has made the end of the move right here. So keep in mind, keep in mind, I'm just going to tell you this straight off the bat. If you end up coming up above this and retesting this, we're, we're moving up to 17,000. Let me just get this out of the way, as long as you don't make a fake out and go down. So break above, retest, boom, 17,000. Have you done that? The thing is, it hasn't really happened and it concerns me. So what really concerns me is that you are getting a lot of sellers here. They're trying to stop the prices from going above. And there could be chances of Pepe actually moving up. As I said before, on the monthly, you're looking for Pepe to have this amazing uh, morning star. And I told you that November is going to look good, right? So November can still end up being green as well. In the next 19 days so there's a lot of days until now uh, to see what decision you make we are approaching the end of the week as well so in the next one day in the next one day uh, keep in mind we don't want to see this thing start to drop down like this then this doji is going to be in effect but the doji is going to be in effect in such a way that you just made a wick to the upside and you start to climb to the downside all of a sudden so this is not really a green candle until you don't close which closes in the next one day and 15 hours. In one day, 15 hours, we really have to see how uh, the candle here really closes. Another thing is, let's go into the daily time frame and uh, let's check it what's going on. So you're pretty much making a hanging man right now. And today, if you do go down here and you go all the way down and you make a red candle closing right there, these three candles are going to be evening star and you're going to start to move even lower. Evening star means basically you're looking for a reversal from a, from an uptrend you're looking for a reversal for a downtrend number two is that on the daily this is a confirmed hanging man right next to the resistance that's also bad you can see if i zoom in there how many times have you tried to break, break above the line but you've been rejected rejection here uh, this is first rejection that's your second rejection and this is your third rejection so that's not good it doesn't look good at all uh, another thing that we may actually take in consideration for why Pepe may start to move and correct to the downside is on the RSI. If you look on the RSI, uh, you have the prices high like this and you have the prices low like that, right? And that is a bearish divergence. And everyone should know about bearish divergence. So this is a bearish divergence. Number two, Pepe went from 6200 all the way to the price of 1400 if i take the measurement and i showed you from there and all the way up here it's a 132 percent move already done 132 percent so this one this move has been uh, has been on ever since 20 of october today is almost 11 or 12 and for any coin that goes 132 there could be 30 percent retracements or even up to 40 percent retracements so if you do go up like this, you are basically going to tend to correct a little bit to the downside. Another reason is that you do have a lot of stop losses that may be down here. Okay. Ever since you break above this demand box, do you remember this double bottom that we talked about and you move to the upside? So there are a lot of stop losses that are still set down there and there could be chances that the market does want to go down and get these people liquidated as well there are chances for that to happen but once again i'm going to end with this if you break above all of these things just go out of the window keep that in mind and uh, be ready for a technical target up here so keep an eye if you break above well and good if you don't then probably the next technical targets are to the demand box which can be nine thousand. so that's it for this quick update i'm going to see you the next one hello office